شهر رمضان الذي أنزل فيه القرآن هدى للناس وبينات من الهدى وبينات من الهدى والفرقان فمن شهد منكم الشهر فليسم ومن كان مريضا أو على سفر فإدة من أيام أخر يريد الله بكم اليسر ولا يريد بكم الأسر ولتكملوا العدة ولتكملوا العدة ولتكبروا الله على ما هداكم ولعلكم تشكرون الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين نبينا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وأصحابه وبعده اللهم أسجد ما السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Tukamar kulun dan gura di dalam kuana aja, mana cik sur tu soal, dah muka cik akan ayat tu pun muka cik dah. Inda Allah tebarak wa taala menjirman tu kan cik cewa. Wakalu Rabbana hajil lana. Wakalu Rabbana hajil lana qibtana qabla yawmil hisab. Mungkin kepada nasu kaprawa namaka. Dah suci kita waktu bayangai nak ingat dah anak tak ada Muhammad Sallam. Dah kuma rasanya dah dah kat itu Allah tabarak wa taala hari kega Allah taala yang apa pun abad kan umumi wajib sebagai bacaan su semua sendiri mana mata yang mana kau Ma kerjaan supaya dia diba. Kapan semua tanya dengan anda binuh, kamu tanya dengan anda bihud, kamu tanya dengan anda Musa Ali Salam Salam, kamu tanya dengan anda bishwale, anda bilum, anda bishuaib. Di kalangan susun kerja teman kalangan susun alat alat itu kerja susun. Tuhan mungkin tu anda suka peramak semua suna syaka suna ku kontrol suna kaya cawan alat alai c semua ada nampak bapa anda sekejirah baca ida ke sawa muda detail tu sih kita tahu tak ada tu lok cinta agama musuhan nak Jadi kalau ramu kasih kecik wakal, orang pada ayah umpan gigi jemu, ajil dan api kita nak ke keutama nak nama lapan nak sama hingga sekian. Kalau kamu susu yang kehendak, tidak ada kiam ada sekian ni, tidak ada macam ada Muhammad SAW ada sekian ni, susu agak keutama nak susu lapan nak sama yang susu nak sedikit sedikit. Kita kapren nak perlu kapren ini susai, kapren ini nak gigak. Kaga dah Allah cakap orang kau dah alam ya, bagi aku ni mana? Ayat bolehlah sekali mengenang semua macam azab atas semua musuh. Ma Allah cakap alam ni aku ni. Bukan mungkin kita mana ni? Lebih baik kita nak dunia yang mana siapa? Kau ayat pun di kena mu. Dah cek mungkin ni sama macam pun boleh kuat Allah wah tu dah sih ni dia nama tu ya sira ya buta amat pun dia dah dolan sah tu Allah terbaik kuat Allah yang nak nanya nak pada kata yang najis aku wah ini orang pakar bersuad lalu ubah jin yang kena pada kata yang najis aku bintu orang yang ibarat susuk aji susuk ini nak cewa ajil dan apa itu nak kagak kau tu nama orang pun yang zina agama kami dah ubis kami dah ubah hisab Kau azab muka badan rana bincik, rana kisah, rana ikir dan ikir, rana nazar apa yang nak, kuat tak apa syarat, ini mungkin cina bini. Khusus kerja ingat kaya ni, agak kau tu nasu azab, akau sih yang jadi. Allah dia puli ni, Allah kara puli tu. Wah, insurut insurut, 
and we read from the beginning of the verse up to verse 15 in which the kuffar were contesting the choice of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in favor of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam to be the leader of the humanity and who was sent with the guidance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that uh, why should he be the one to be sent after all there were more influential people uh, more than him then Allah the Most High confirmed that it is to him belong the treasury of the heavens and the earth therefore he has the right nobody can challenge Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's choice therefore it has been confirmed the messenger sallallahu alayhi wasallam is the leader of humanity so those generations before the kuffar of Mecca the Ad, the Thamud, people of Shu'aib and so on rejected and belied their messengers therefore Allah the Most High said and uh, dealt with them and for the kuffar of Mecca who belied the Prophet sallallahu said that they were not waiting for anything except a single blast with that they will uh, have no respite Allah will deal with all of them then now they are speaking وَقَالُوا رَبَّنَا عَجِلْ لَنَا قِتَنَا They say, O oh, our Lord, عَجِلْ لَنَا قِتَنَا Hasten our share of punishment قَبْلَ يَوْمِ الْحِسَابِ Before the day of accountability. Meaning, if it is possible that you can do it, as your Prophet Muhammad told us, then therefore, hasten the punishment now, now, if it is, if, 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 uh, if it is possible, if it was possible. You see, the kuffar were so arrogant that uh, they speak the way they like to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, but Allah the Most High is patient. Therefore, he did not punish them as they requested because Allah has set a time for their destruction. <laughs> إِنَّهُ أَوَّابَ دومان مانغنوس أقوى يقونا زوجيا كسان شيوا سرا يان أدم باسوس كان شكاونا سبا سدوبي جرما إرنا أنني محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم سوشيكا غيا وبنجل ناكا يجد وطيبنا أتاما أقوى يسجلي أتي Kau isgili bapa. Tuan Abu Yahya tak pandai Muhammad Sallam. Salat Allah baca puni. Salat Allah cinta si Isbel. Kaya puni. Dah mengulai di depan depan anak bawa pandai Muhammad Sallam. Puni semua Allah Allah dekat sana. Wasbir, Omasa baru ke Allah bila. Kaya puni. Karena yang aku ini doa Allah. Wasbir. Kama sabar ulil azmin al-rusul Kaya puli Kama yada manya manya manza ni maga bacaan Yang wangka semua sekai hapuli Kisah dua deki hapuli arayuasa Zai galaba adu abin di sa'aka Matikar kaya hapuli dan Allah Tu Allah ba'adhi barka Fu azaman tikiwa na awli ni iya nika Kana tayin hapuli Kana tayin hapuli Tu kala kena dawa Idang itu cukup kita puli dan begini nanti, tena tahu puli, tena tahu puli, tuan ada apa? Haka mak ayat tangka, haka akal suah, haka duit nak kaji kena dah puli, tuan tak kena dah apa? Mungkin bayi nasrah, awak nak rayu atau dunia saya ada dah puli. Bagi cuma benda yang cuma lahiran, nak aljana, dah puli, mati ibu bapa, siapa dia? Dua dah kerja, ia nama aman ada jemaah, bapa sama kecil ni cerita si bapa dah, ia nak dapat ini. Tuhan nama asal tu buah puli, ane Muhammad sesalah jadi buah puli. Baca bayi mih aku dan sama, baca bayi mih aku dan sama. Si sama tak nang makka, bas kapak kama si tuan nak guna cewa kasih, semudah aku dan sama. Allah Taala itu sih isbir alam ayat ulun. Kaya hapuli bisa zaman tu tu kan bagang ganun semua ada di. Jaga ciki sunci anda mau kasih wajah Allah. Sunci itu sih makan ini. Sunci mesihirin ini. Sunci mau aki ini. 
abin da ka sani sun aibata annabi muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam kata bawo mu Dawud dal aidi me sanannan karfi annabi Dauda yana da karfi ba kan karfi wajen imani karfi wajen ibada karfi wajen biyayya karfi wajen iya fuskan tambara zanan kafirai kuma ya tsaya ba ja da fari duk Allah ta'ala ba shi wannan karfi alayhi salatu wassalam hatta malamai sun bace karfin sa lafiya innahu awwab Nabi Dawud alaihi salatu wassalam ya kasance mai yawan komawa ga Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala mai istighfar mai tawakkul mai karfi komai na al'amarin sa zai mai daga Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala to annabi Allah ta'ala yana so yi ba wa annabi Muhammad sallallahu Hama sun ce suna jiran azaban Allah ko iya zan bila O messenger of Allah you should be patient ala ma yaqulun over what they used to say the comment they used to make against you what they used to attribute to you which you were uh, innocent uh, of any of them you should be patient O prophet of Allah Allah the Most High in other verses of the glorious Quran apart from these called upon the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and commanded him to be patient. Wasbir wa ma sabruka illa billah. You should be patient. Your patience is for none but for Allah the Most High for the sake of Allah. Wasbir kama sabara ulul azmi min ar-rusul. You should be patient just like those high class of messengers who were patient. Uh, all these the prophet allah the most high was addressing his messenger in order to be patient from all these things disobedience silly questions and what they were attributing against him saying that he was mad he was a poet he invented the quran it was not from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he was telling lie and so on this indeed very very painful for someone whom the world testified that he is the most trustful trustworthy personality then some people will be pointing and accusing finger to him saying that he was a poet he was insane he invented the quran and so on allah the most high said isbir ala ma yaqulun be patient over what they used to say wadhkur abdana daud al aid and then remember our servant uh, daud daud was also a messenger of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he was worthy he was powerful he was given power and then his son Suleiman inherited uh, that power after Dawood and he was even more powerful than Suleiman was remember this our great servant listen to his own uh, life story so that you learn something from it so that with that you will become and you will be patient with from what they were attributing to in nahu dal aid Dawood was a uh, possessor of strength someone whom Allah the Most High described as someone with strength you can imagine you cannot imagine how powerful that personality was Dawood alayhi salatu wasalam was confirmed to be extraordinarily courageous Dawood alayhi salatu wasalam was strong in his patience in terms of worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he was also so strong in his uh, 
staying away from committing whatever Allah the Most High has forbidden. That's why Allah the Most High described him as the aid, possessor of strength. Innahu awab, certainly Allah uh, Dawood was awab, repeatedly turning to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala everything Allah Dawood used to refer it to Allah the Most High, he used to rely on Allah the Most High without uh, uh, thinking of any other thing. So Allah the Most High praised Dawood for these uh, great qualities. Inna sakharna, inna sakharna al-jibal ma'ahu yusabbihna bil-ashi wal-ishraq. Shina he want tasbih. He don't want tasbih. Dua zuhu, shina tasbih at al-ashi. Tayyab al-kamu ala maribani. He don't want tasbih. Dua zuhu, shina ki wa'ida shidu shuma shina tasbih at al-ashi. Allah tabarak wa ta'ala chi inna sakharna al-jibala ma'ahu munghore duwansu sawni manya manya atarada shi al-nabi Dawud munghu watu munghu watu munghu watu shi Allah ta'ala ya huri mishwa inan duwansu kakin zaakiwa zaaka jake tazbihi duwansi yehi tazbihi ba yehi reka yehi tazbihi kaka tibi amma shi idanya na yehi suna yehi atarada shi Allah ya huri mishwa inan Allah Ta'ala Chi Yusabbihna bil ashim wal ishraq Yana tasbihi Watu aynin Mareche Tasabiyya Loka chinda rana ki huduwa Da loka chinda aynin rana ki maduwa Tasabi Da yamma Dib al Nabi Dawud alayhi salatu salam Yana ambatan Allah yana tasbihi Suma duwa thun kuma ta'ala shi salatu salam Ada loko kecil dari semua tasbih, semua saya semua tasbih. Am pertama tasbih, anak. Arah kita Allah Taala kau Taala. Ia nak demi manusia, wajan sabun, karipi, karipi na imani, dak karipi na jiki, dak karipi na watu ayam jaring taka. Di tasbih ia nak jawab macam mana? Yang am pertama Allah Taala kau Taala. Kuma kau tinggal nak cuci hidup dekat sini, bau tinggal nak jangan cuci hidup nak kita nak nunggu nak dapat bapa, kau nak jangan cuci hidup nak suruh tu, kau nak jangan cuci hidup nak keran tak orang ni, kau nak jangan cuci hidup nak sorang orang cuci hidup, agak mudah ya bapa. Nusuan nak kita hantar hantar lingkau jauh kuda, kena tahan Allah. Aisyah kau tak kasua, ia nak serwa, ia nak jangan cuci hidup. Nau orang kaya ni mana, mau cuci hidup nak nasi nasi, bayi hak dua. Nusuah mungkin leh terawang kelir sekebada. Yang apa nak kerja kan awak nak disuruh masa kena jenjaz bi kan awak nak disuruh bayi mah. Tak terawang kelir aje kebada. Semua tasbih ibadah di mejer mah. Kamu kena tak tahu nama ni Allah tuan tuan tuan. Amma yang saya kesal mu anda itu tasbih kamu abu masa. Tinggal lagi bayi mati nanti kerja yang kau dah saya kau dah tasbih kau bayi nanti. Hang kelir satu macam mana macam. Tanah waktu tu ni anda bang. Dunia cik bani, dunia maya ya karak bani, ah ya bah kali aja dah. Tasbih, bah kat mana nak kau masih Allah? Tu orang mana tasbih mekali bi? Si an Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, An Nabi Dawud Alaihi Salatu Salam, Allah Taala kibah melabari. Ida yang lain, dua zul fauni, dub sunat terasi, terasi aja tasbih. Allah Taala karam al iman. Now Allah the Most High starts telling the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and by extension we the Muslims who are reading the Quran about Dawood Alayhi Salatu Wasallam. Who was Dawood Alayhi Salatu Wasallam? Allah says, Inna sakharna al-jibala ma'ahu. We have subjected jibala mountains ma'ahu together with him, Dawood Alayhi Salatu Wasallam, yusabihna. They were glorifying the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala together with Dawood alayhi salam. So this one is enough to tell you that Dawood was indeed a special servant of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Whenever Dawood sits down glorifying Allah the Most High, saying subhanallah, subhanallah, all the mountains around will also pick up tasbih together with Dawood alayhi salam. This is indeed a great servant of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Bil Ashi, the time he used to 
rehearse that tasbih is bil ashi in the afternoon wal ishraq and during sunrise in the morning so whenever he sat down counting his tasbih subhanallah subhanallah all the mountains stones rocks and everything around him will pick up doing tasbih along with say Dawood alayhi salatu wa salam tasbih that is exalting or glorification of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is one of uh, the uh, very important adhkar that a Muslim should be engaging into every day and every moment and it is not mere doing tasbih rather you do that tasbih while you are calm you are attentive and then pondering over the meaning of what that word of tasbih is conveying attributing them to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as it fits his majesty and so on that is the type of tasbih required of you and that was the tasbih done by Dawood and the mountains together with him that's why through that tasbih Dawood alayhi salatu wasalam got strength in terms of his iman strength in terms of his even the building of his body because the more you are together with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the more strong you become in your heart the more strong you become in your iman the more strong you become in your physical activity the more healthier you become if you submit yourself to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala worshiping him and doing tasbih in uh, for Allah the most high so this was Dawood alayhi salatu wasalam contrary to the tasbih we are doing whereby a person will be doing tasbih as he was also discussing his tasbih he's doing tasbih he's discussing with another person he's doing tasbih he is also uh, reciting the Quran he's doing tasbih he, no this is not the type of tasbih expected of you and it's not the type that uh, gave Dawood that extraordinary strength of iman and strength in his body strength in his obedience to Allah the most high والطير محشورة كل له أواب داود عليه الصلاة والسلام هذا من صعيبة بدوا سو كذبا سو صعيبة سكتروا سو ما سو سو كبات على بان سما وانا يزو وانا يزو سكتروا سو ما سنا تسبيدا من داود عليه الصلاة تعالى أبونا بقى ما يجيني الله تبارك وتعالى شيء والطير محشورة Unsai suma sekarang tercari, warna yang jauh, warna yang jauh tu susu tahu. Agamanya Nabi Dawud Alaihissalatu Wassalam, kulu lawu awab, dukkan yang sunat tasbih, dukkan yang sunat maida al amur yang suka umur nanti si Nabi Dawud Alaihissalatu Wassalam dibayar. Kaga, asyik unsai ma, sunat nafas tasbih, dua suma, sunat nafas tasbih, malat alai tempat tertawannya, cari dah Nabi Dawud Alaihissalatu Wassalam, sebut ekirma dah mati nafas tasbih. But also what they are mahshura. So also birds were assembled before Dawood alayhi salatu wasalam. Kullu lahu awab. All of them were repeating praises to Allah the Most High. So this was Dawood alayhi salatu wasalam who did tasbih and also other creatures of Allah the Most High pick be from him and they chanted uh, it together with him washadadna mulkahu wa atainahu al-hikmata wa fasla al-khitab haka na nabi dawla alayhi salatu wa salam wadda idangina yi duwa su suna yi idangina yi duwa su suna yi suma suna yi si ala ta'ala chi washadadna mulkahu muka karma wa muliki ma nabi dawla Mulai kita ada bidang dia nak ada kerja fiba nafas. Ida yang pada umur ni dulu lagi. Inya hana hano. Mana sih ni mulai? Mulai kita bangun masa baru. Mulai kita nak ada kerja fiba. Kuma ida Allah Taala bang. Mulai kita kuma ada kerja mulai kita dekau. Kita patut dah. Anak biaya ke Allah Taala kuma Taala inda daerah mulai kita kaji. Dengan kaya abin tambah ni awal nanda era. Kaya yang zaki dengan. Kerja kerja orang awal mulai cik gidang kan jago orang sih tu ia awal neng gidang Allah di tempat kita awal di kibarwa gidang Allah ibarat lokal gemen Nigeria ibarat cewa awal tu zat tempat kita awal di kibudan awal nawa dan 
aka baka gwamna Allah zai tambaye ka a jihar ka aka baka Najeriya ga baki daya Allah zai tambaye ka bidan Najeriya hatta dabbobin ciki ya akai ya sa mulki ba mun wasa ba a musulunci mulki kuma to yana iya takawa idan kai abun ataka kai mulki za ta taka ka kuma ka ta kuma ba sarakin a bashi ladan taka ka kuma mulki yana bukatun tausayi wadda ba su da shi ka tausaya musu idan ka tausaya musu a baka lada in ka tsananta musu Allah ya tsananta maka ko a nan ko a can ko duka shi sa jagoranci ba mun wasa ba ne ana son wanda aka ba mulki tsayi wajen ibada alladhina in mankannahum fil ardi aqamu salata wa atu zakata wa amru bil ma'ruf wa nahu 'anil munkar wa lillahi aqibatul umur wa idan muka ba su mulki ana son su tsayi wajen salla sai wajen zakka sai wajen umurni da kyawawan ayyuka tasbih ibada salla umra haji duk abin da ya shafi ibada mai mulki wanda aka ba jagora ya tsayi akai kuma ya hana mu yabun ayyuka su luwadi su sata su zina su kama mutane duk abin da aka ce haramun ne mai mulki amfani da karin mulkin sai ya tabbas dan shi ba magana ne na baki ba magana ne ko kai ko ataka ka da dukkan abin da ake da shi na karfi da karfin soja da karfin police da yan sandan ciki da na waje da kowa mai mulki amfani da shi ga cewa duk an daina duk wani barna kuma lada da samu idan ya sakaci ruqiyama mai mulki zai shiga shi yasa masu mulki ruqiyama wasu su a daure za a kawo su ga Allah ta baka ruqiyama to Allah ta ala sai ya ba mu annabi da wato yace wa shadad na mulkahu muka karfa mulkin su domin me mulki ne wanda ya gina akan adalci sai Allah ya karfa shi kara mushi karfi wa atina wa hikma Allah ta ala ce sai muka bashi wato hikima a da wai ma masu fassara a tafsiri suka ce an bashi wato annabta an bashi kuma ilimi an bashi kuma ita zagoran kalmar ta kai hikima an bashi ta shine mutum ya zama to wato yana da basira yana da waye waye yana da fahimta yana da ganewa mai hikima shi ke dora abu inda ya dace sai ai laifi guda biyu sai zan tafi kuncin kowa ne daban-daban saboda irin yanayin da wannan yake da wannan yanayin da wannan yake a hikima babban al'amari ne Allah ta'ala yana ba wa bai so yutal hikmata man yasha kuma yutal hikmata faqad utiya khayran kafira Allah yana ba da hikima ga wanda yazo duk wanda aka bashi hikima to an bashi wato alkhairi mai girma to sai Allah ta'ala yake ce mana bayan ya karfa mulkin Dawud alayhi salatu wassalam kuma sai kara mushi da hikima abu na ukun aka bashi a wannan aya wa fasul al-qita' ana rabe magana ana so shugaba da iya gane maganganun mutane ai ka zo ka ce a ayi an yi kaza an yi kaza an yi kaza kana wani layi to zai gano ka saboda tun kana fara magana yana iya gano ka saboda bai wanda Allah ta'ala yake waje gwaran shi musamman alkali a kotu da ka zo ka so mu surutu dan wadannan surutu suke yi ko lawa ya son barin turanci ya ja wancan ya hada da wannan ya bugo wannan ya hada yana da turanci ga wannan ci wannan kariya ke zan koyi magadanka to shine fasal al-khita saboda wasu Allah ya ba su magana idan ya so mu je rawa magana sai ka rude to shugaba da Allah ya taimaka da rarrabe magana duk surutun ga zai gane ka ya san kariya kake to Allah ta'ala ba wa Nabi Dawud fahimta na bayani da mutane suna bayani Allah says wa shadadna mulkahu we strengthen his kingdom the power given to Dawud alayhi salatu wasalam was indeed a very strong power Allah the most high bestow power on Dawud alayhi salatu wasalam again wa atinahu alhikmata and we bestow on him hikma that is wisdom wisdom here refers to the prophethood that Allah the most high gave to Dawud alayhi salam so the mulk that was granted to him uh, Allah the most high when he gives you mulk even today you as a head of family you are in charge and you are going to be held responsible or accountable before Allah 
concerning that to your family. If the, uh, your territory expands more, that you are controlling a particular local government or a state or a country, yes, then the question also expands because the responsibility become more and more. With this, if you fail to that responsibility, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will ask you. If you are able to discharge it diligently, Allah the Most High will uh, reward you and then Allah the Most High will make paradise your abode. Allah the Most High charges the leaders at whatever category or whatever level that they should be uh, establishing prayers, commanding people to do good and also forbid them from doing bad. Allah says, Alladina imakannahum fil ardi. Those whom if we establish them on the earth by giving them power, aqamu uh, salah, they establish prayer they, or they are pass, or they are in their person and also make all their subjects also to be establishing prayer. Aqamu salah wa atu zakah, they also give zakat, uh, the right of uh, their wealth. Aqamu salah wa atu zakat wa amaru bil ma'ruf, they do command others to do good after doing that goodness wanahu anil munkar they forbid people from doing bad walillahi aqibatul umur so any leader who does not establish prayer right from leadership of a family he doesn't pray he doesn't command his uh, subjects his family to pray also uh, if he is a chairman in a local government he doesn't command people to do good he doesn't uh, encourage them or uh, discourage them from doing bad. He doesn't punish the criminals. He allows them to uh, do whatever they like, to unleash whatever uh, trouble on the peace-loving citizen of a uh, local government or state or country, then Allah the Most High will definitely ask that uh, leader. So the mulk of Dawood was so strong because it was based on uh, Adil, that is justice. What now hikmata? We gave him hikmah. Either prophethood, uh, it, uh, it is part of the hikmah. Some say hikmah, wisdom, when he speaks. When, whenever Dawud wasalam, spoke, you see and you understand, you see hikmah in his uh, speech. Wa fasl al khitab and sound judgment. Allah gave him sound judgment. Whenever case was brought to Dawood, he passed judgment, his judgment was indeed sound, accepted by Allah subhanahu uh, wa ta'ala. So hikmah is a great endowment and achievement if Allah bestows it to an individual because Allah says, yu'til hikmata mayyesha. Allah grants hikmah to whom he wishes. Wa man yu'til hikmata, whosoever Allah the Most High granted hikmah faqad utiya khairan kathira. He has indeed been given uh, uh, goodness. Wal attack a number of Hosme the Tasawarul Mehrab. Shizaka, when you know much Kadan, the Katshina, you are the Bidau Dani. To Anna, I and Allah Alana Chiwa, while attack a number of Hosme, Shilla Bad and Masu, Suman, and Yazuma Kayaka, and Muhammad Sasala. I think I shall be named what to Annabi Dowd Alisa. My name is somebody down the Labada. I like you, so there must have been the one with Dowd Alisa. While attacker Nabul Hassan, Shin Labada and Namasu Suma Yazumaka is the Sawal Behrab. I look at the Sulla like a girl, Sukau Katanga. Sudan the guns. Suka wa katanga suka haura Suka duro kasa Awasuma ala maisa kache Katanga masala chi suka haura Suka talla kose suka dira Shukma nabi Dawood alayhi salatu wa salam Deiki mutinni wa yon ibada Dida aloka chamba kutani ya masala chi Amma shiena na yena ibada Kuhuna suri suka che aa Awali agarun dira suka talla kasa Talla ka garun Katanga, Sumpalu, Suka Samu, and Nabi Dawood in a Chi Ibadan. Baka Aji Sumutun, Yewe Ti Ibadan, Uwe, Yekuma Yewe Ti Ibadan, Da Akasa Adole Zee Chikin Jama'a. Kare Chi Aa, Wanna Ibadan Chikin Jama'a Ni, Idan Na Jiza Achi Ibadan Allah Wadi Aa, Tunda Allah Ta'ala Chi Ayi Chikin Jama'a, Tukai Chikin Jama'a. 
sallam jami'i da ake kai na da salloli guda biyar cikin jama'a to kai dole cikin jama'a ba gaskiya bane kace kana da imani kai na kaza kai naka a gida dan kar a gari akwai kuma ibadu dewa wanda aka baka daman kai shi daga kai sai Allah ba wanda ma ya sani kai sadaka ba wanda ya sani kai zikiri kana gidan ka kai istighfari kai salati ga Allah sallam ka karanta alqur'ani kai abubuwa da dama wanda na boye ne to haka suka dalla ku katanga tsallake ga ru suka samu annabi dawuda ina cikin ibada na Allah the most high continues telling the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam about Dawud alayhi salam this was a situation whereby Dawud was uh, uh, sitting alone worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the mosque he was not expecting anybody then he just saw Khasm has the story of Khasm has the story of litigants people who has problem between themselves two people with problem between themselves so they wanted judgment from Dawud alayhi salatu wa salam so without any permission without expecting is tasawwar al mihrab they just climb the wall they jump into the wall oya and met daud at his prayer chamber chamber is tasawwar al mihrab when they climbed over they jumped over the wall so into the mosque or at the place where daud alayhi salatu wasalam secluded himself worshiping allah subhanahu wa ta'ala إذ دخلوا على داود ففزع منهم قالوا لا تخف خصمان بغى بعضنا على بعض فاحكم بيننا بالحق ولا تشطط فاحكم بيننا بالحق ولا تشطط واهدنا الى سواء الصراط اسن النبي داوود عليه الصلاه والسلام دعوا ان متعدي بدابي الله تعالى يتم بان محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم شيوا شن لابد وان ماسو سما بدابي يا زوبكا يا ان صلى الله عليه dakalu ala dauda sai ga shi nan sun fado akan dauda alayhi salatu wassalam fa fazi aminu sai furgita sai tsorata shi sa akwai tsoron da mutum zai tsorata shar'a ba ta hana ba annabi Allah ne shi su ma su mai ne amma da suka duro a takatanga suka tsalla ko suka fado bai zace zai gansu ba yana gansu sai furgita sai tsorata wannan tsoro ne ta dabi'a yan za mutum zai ga maciji shi masallacin nan gaban sa yana iya tsorata ganin sa na farko kafin ya shi ya dawara to ya kira ladan to nan tsoron da mutum zai na kage abu abu tsoro ka tsorata ba laifi ba ne a shara ba za a kama ka laifi ba Allah ta'ala ba zai kama ka laifi mu nan tsoron duk dan adam yana da wannan adabiya kaman ka ji mu wane ba laifi ka ba ne aka aika yau ka za ka ji mu haka nan tsoro haka nan farin ciki Allah ta'ala bai kawo bayan sa da wani duk jarun duka annabi Musa alayhi salatu wasalam shi ma ya irin wannan tsoro lokacin da Allah ta'ala ya tambaye shi mai a hannun ka ya Musa ya ce sanda ta shi ina kaza ina kaza ka ci ji farin ciki ya ga macijiya ta yi kansa kuma ta riga bai miki a Musa kala hi asa a tawakkau alayha wa ushu biha ala ghadim wala fiha ma'arib ukra kala alqiha ya Musa fa alqaha fa idha hi hayatu tasa kala husha domin da ya tambaye shi ka san wannan sanda na sanda ta ka ce eh me kake da ita ina kaza ina kaza ina kaza ina kaza to je fadar sanda mu gani yana je fadar sanda ita wannan tumaci ja tai kansa sai tsorata Allah ta ala ce husha wala ta khaf ke na ya tsorata dake wannan sanda kar ka tsorata to irin wannan tsorata da bai yace kowa yana iya samun ta to shine annabi dawud da ya ga mutane kawai sun duro mai gida ko sun duro mai wajen ibada ko masallaci sai ya furgita Allah ji a a su wa'annan mutane da kan sun gane annabi dawud ya furgita sai suka ce da shi fa fazi amin kanu la takhaf kar ka tsorata khasmani masu husuma ne guda biyu baka ba'duna ala ba'di shashin wato dayan ya zara shi dan wansa dayan mu ya kwari dan wansa dayan mu ya ci shi dan wansa dayan mu ya yi zamba kan dan wansa to kaga a matsayin ka na alkali sai ka nutsu tunda kai baka wajen akai zalunci kaga da wannan ma koran su zai ya za ku fa 
ko nga katanda ko si pada sudah pada Nabi Daud sayyidu sayyidina sallallahu alaihi wasallam fi na farkon wanda ke bayani daman dan bayani ya yi bayani shi sa kai hatta idan mutane sai kawo maka wa wani abu da wanda zaka yi hukunci sai ka nuso da kyau kar ka damu da maganar mai iya magana wani ma bai iya dogon magana ba amma shi ke da gaskiya saboda ba maganar sai a bashi rashin gaskiya yake a dayan mu ya ba dan wansa ko ya zaki dan wansa ala ba'd na ala ba'd fahum bainana bil haqq shi mai bayani yake cewa annabi dawo tunda dai ya ba'i daya ko dai ya zambanci daya to kai hukunci a tsakanin mu hukunci da gaskiya ta ga ya fada gaskiya amma a rabin Allah ai ba shi ka ce mai gaskiya ba ai shi din shi ne akan gaskiya ba wanda ya sallamo katanga ba ba izini ba sallama a ga wanda ya sallamo katanga mai sallama ai kamata a ga bulala tun ga bai bayani saboda ya keta dokoki in kai hukunci ba kanan mu da gaskiya wala tu shi ta kuma kar ka ketare haddi ta ji shi shi wanda ke kawo karan shi ke wannan sharda wa hadina الى سواء الصراط سانن كشير ده زوا تبركي ولا كشير تبركي دي دي هنيا ما دي دي هنيا ده غسكيا كدورا ما كاي تو ان شي ني ابن ده سكباتو النبي داوود عليه السلام then they told him that he should not fear this was their situation there was problem between them then he was a judge let him judge between them bil haqqi with truth wala tushri do not exceed limit wahdina ila sawa israb and guide us to the right path inna hadha akhi lahu tis'u wa tis'una na'jatahu wa liya na'jatu wahida wa liya na'jatu wahida faqala akfilniha wa azzani fil khitab hatta nasubu suka fadu dai ne so bayani dai yana ji abin da ake fada shi mai bayani yace inna hadha akhi ya kai adabi dawo da wannan dan uwana ne ni dan tsallo ko katanga da wannan abokin tsallo katanga tare da ni dan uwana ne shi inna hadha akhi lahu tis'un tis'an lahu tis'un wa tis'un naja a shi dan wannawa yana tunkiya 99 tis'un wa tis'un tinkiya yana da 99 to shi kuma zai bayani abin da yake da shi yace wali ya laja tun wahida ni kuma ina da tunkiya ba dai ta a to ba kowa da azikin sa ba mai 99 idan bai da kayan sa mai dai ma ya kama anya da kayan sa wani ma ba ya da ko daya wani ma kuma yana efin 99 Allah ke rabo ya ba mu wanda yake ni kuma hana wanda yake to bayan ya wannan bayanin da annabi Dawud fa qala akfilniha sai shi dan wannan wa mai tasa inda ta sai ce wai ka ba ni na ka dayan nan kalamun cin mu nan dai ba ni shi a to ya fi sabilillahi wanda yake da ba dai talba a washi ba mai tarar ne za a ƙara mushi cika dari amma duk shi yake bayani ba san mai ba ba yake dan bayani in ka zaura da zaka yi shi kada yake ta bayani tun da aka wala na jitu wahida ina tunkiya ba da amma sai yace ni kalamun ce ne ga bani shi hada da nawa wa azzani fil khata kuma da yake shi yana da magana sai ya kure ni ko kuma wato ainin ya gama da ni ko kuma wato ainin ya gama sadda ni a bayanin sa na cewa ni sai na bashi wannan ba da yana ta dawo na yana ta dawo ai na bashi ba da to duka haka annabi dawo bai ci ko domin dan bai magana ba mai cewa dan wana ne mai cewa yana da kaza ina da kaza duk shi ne da yake ta magana mai cewa lalle ai gaskiya lalle kuma a dora su duk shi kada yake ta bayi those two litigants one of them started making explanation presenting his case before judge meaning daud alayhi salatu wasalam he introduced himself by saying inna hadha akhi say this is my brother lahu tis'un wa tis'una na'jatan he had 
99 sheep walia na'jatun wahida and i have only one sheep faqala akhfilniha then the owner of 99 now said akhfilniha oh my brother hand it over to me wa azani fil khitab and he overpowered me in speech so from his statement it can be understood that yes that person wanted to dominate that poor person someone with 99 instead of him at least to give him maybe 5 or 10 9 to make 10 while he has 9 that would have been good but the only one his brother had he want to dominate he want to confiscate it and then add to his 99 and have 100 while that one will have zero so you see if you are a judge if this case is presented to you 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 feel bad and you feel that this person has been oppressed therefore you will instantly take action so this was what was presented but the other person was not given chance to respond he did not talk either to refute or to confirm what was said by his brother قال لقد ظلمك بسؤال نعجتك الى نعاجه وان كثيرا من الخلطاء لا يبغي بعضهم على بعض الا الذين امنوا الا الذين امنوا وعملوا الصالحات وقليل ما هم وظن داوود ان ما فتناه فاستغفر ربه وخر راكعا وانا باتو سيدي يا وانك ان كما الكالي باتو سيدي زي ما هي كما كان تو سي مجان اه كان هذا تو سي كما كان هذا بولانا دك بي ذاك ابا كما دراوني موتي يدان بي دي ba daka ta mai zafi ne duk karin mutum ko bai dai ba daka ta kwara shi kai da mu kana wajen da kai ka tabbatar da adalci to saboda haka shi ne tunkiya dai talshi ke ta bayan jin da aka shi ke cewa ai da gaskiya shi ke cewa kada ai cuta shi ke cewa shi ke da kwaya daya wanda yana da cewa inda tare kuma yace a ne yana ne mai kwace mai dai mu yana da gashi duk shi ke bayan wancan na jin da ke ustazu ne shi ne ce komai ba yana yana jiran abin da za a yi kai annabi dawud tausayi sai kama ka ta ga ya mai mai cewa inda tara zai da ko da wasan ce kuma a kawo da dan mai zai da shi yana gama magana sai annabi dawud da yankun shi qala laqad zalamaka bi su'ali na ajatika ila ni'aji lalle ya zalunce ka da ya nemi ya kwace ma tun ke ka kwaya da ya da nan ci sai da tare da wato ne ya zabi ce ka kaga mai mai bayanin sai ji dadi tun da tun ba a je ko ina ba an so ba shi gaskiya kuma shi ya so ba cewa ba a yi gaskiya amma ba a kawo hanyar ta ba duk da annabin Allah ne guda shi sa dole duk wani alkali ya samu ni suwa idan an kawo shi wato aini ku suma gaban sa kada yadda tausayi ya sashi mu ci iyaka ko kuma tsananin ya sashi mu ci iyaka yace ya zalunce ka wa inna kasira min al-khulata la yabdi ba'dhum ala ba'dhi da yawa cikin masu hadaka wanda suke hada dukiyoyin su a waje guda kamar sharka kamar company to shashi ha yana yana zalunta shashi ba'dhum ala ba'dhi shashi sai su danne dukiyar shashi idan an hada dukiya idan ba a samu imani ba sai wannan ya zalunci wannan mai karfi sai ƙara danna mara sakar musamman idan karfin sai na da yawa a kan fanin ko shi ne director ko shi ne waye sai abin da ya gidan ba zai yi to da yawa ana samu haka kuma haka din ne a rayuwoyin adam mai karfi ya fi danna mara karfi a zo maganar kudi shi zai ba ka aiki ko shi zai ci ga abin da zai ba ka idan ka ce a sai kore kai ne mu to kai ba ka da karfi na kana ne mun na ce ba ne ba yadda a yadda aka yi da kawo saka galibi sai ka samu wanda ke dauni shi da yadda kana neman bashi a wajen mai karfi kai ba ka da karfi dan bashi da za ka dan juya ka dan samu da muna sai ke to za a ba ka dubu dari bashi duk wata za ka ƙara dubu goma to wai mai karfi wai mai rawo 
shi mai barin shine mai zafi kuma shine kuma in ya baka dubu 100 dubu wata daya za ka kawo dubu 100 da goma wata biyu ba ka kawo ba dubu 120 wata uku da 30 wata hudu wata goma za ka kawo dubu 100 kuma za ka kawo dubu 100 kaga shi ke da karfi kuma shi ke zarin shi ai shi sa aka kashe tattalin arzikin kasashe saboda masu karfi suke danna marasa ka tafi ji wani kasar afrika wanda ta kwaci kanta irin su libiya da suka yi musu kwaci kansu ai ga abin da yake kullun kai ne mai rauni kuma kai ne za a fita a baka bashin dole a baka shodan bashin dole kuma ka kawo har ka zaman tubawa dukiyan ka magaba da yana halin bin to haka rayuwa take shi sa ake kwaɗe musulmi ya zanto mai karfi ya taimaka masu rauni in ka ba da bashi ba ruwa wani eh dubu 100 nan na baka bashi ka juya nan da shekara daya abin da ake ci ka nan da shekara daya shi ma sai ka samu ya samu dubu 100 kuma ya dawo da dubu 100 naka naka ya albarka na shi ya albarka kuma kai ta samun lada ke nan har abadan abada duk abin da ya da wannan duke ya samu wani abu kana da lada duk wanda ya ciyar kana da lada in ya zakka ba kana da lada dan kai ne sanadi ai masu kudi an ba su kofar shiga aljanna tuntuni a duniya amma da yawan su iske sai sun tara duwanda an riga an ba su ta ai yanzu abin da ya samu cikin bala'i nan mu kasan tattalin arzikin mu shine mai karfi ya danna mara karfi to idan karfin yayi karfi sai ka samu ba su da ma komai karfin kawai suke ci dukiyar ma ba su da ita karfin kawai suke ci a danne ka dole a baka bashin ma wannan dole za a baka wannan lokaci bashin dole ka taba ji mu tika bayan bashin dole kuma ka kaba ma yaban dole kuma dole sai ka biya to ala ta'ala ya ce annabi daud yana cin wannan bayani sai ci a ai ya zalunce ka saboda gashi da karfi kuma yana neman wato ainihi ya baci dan kadan kake da shi ya ce haka masu wato hadaka suke su danne shashi su danne shashi ala ta'ala ce illal ladina amanu sai dai masu imani su ne ba su haka wa amilu salihati suka aiki na kware har yanzu ana samu masu kudi na kware sai ma kuma rashin gaskiyar jama'a da an samu na kware ne sai a ba samu shi alaji ka samu wa sun cewa a taimaka mu ina nan yan yan abin nan yan environmental so ba ci kaya na suka tafi da shi a bota jahilin da ke ciki dubu 200 ne nayi 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 sun hana to shi ke nan ga dubu 200 ka juya nan da wata uku ka goka abin da ake ci ai shi ke nan ba zai kara ganin sa ba ya tafi sai dai ake maruka nemo shi amma dai ya tsalli kina ke ga saboda dubu 200 da yawa an tura ta masu wuri haka za ka suma sai ran so ke ke shi ba ta sai ya ce saboda ya jarraba wannan an cuce shi ya jarraba wannan an cuce shi musamman idan an san kai mai kudin da dan kusa da kusa ne to an gama da kai za a ce ba an kaje tukun naka ce mushi salamu alaikum to dole ya ansa ka dage wannan ranka kuma wannan kai yana sama dan ka san kai kusa zuni ka sa fararan kaya inda iko ka sa rawani ka ka ga ba ni da lafiya to amma ku ni ka ta bishi ina amfani da lafiya Allah ta'ala ya ce masu imani da aiki na kware ba su haka wa qalilun ma hum amma wa inda aka ambata masu kadan ne Allah da kanzai bana ya ce wa qalilun ma kadan ne zaka samu shi masu imani wanda suke wannan to bayan annabi Dawud ya yi hukunci dan ya riga ya ba ma me 99 ya ba shi rashin gaskiya ya ba mai kwaɗe mai sai gaskiya ba a saurare shi ba ba saurare shi ba to ai san ba shi dama ka san shi usan su ai ba shi shi ai da wani ana kare za mu gana zai ci alkali ba haka ai shi yana jin su saboda imanin sa aka ba shi shi gaskiya to annabi dawud yana kare wannan bayani da yake da mai hikima ne sai gane fa an buga wannan hukuncin ba ita da kyau ba ban ba shi dama ya ba ne shi sai allah ta'ala ce wa zanna dawud anna ma futannahu sai annabi dawud ya zato kyakkyawa na cewa lalle allah ta'ala ya jarrabe shi jarrabawa cewa na duk inda yake hukunci sai ya saurara kowa duk girman ka dan ba ruwan kai kenan sai kai magana sai ya magana sa'an nan in ta bukaci a rantsuwa in ta bukaci a nemo shedu duk sai a yi a nan sai gane allah ta'ala ya jarrabe shi 
Allah ta'ala ce wa zanna Dawuda anna ma fitannahu annabi Dawuda sai tsammanci lalle mu mun jarbe shi mu mai jar mun jarbe shi mu mai jarba ko bai ce rabban ba fastaghfara rabbahu ta ke sai kama istighfari shi sa duk abin da kai wa Allah na laifi to ka duba fastaghfara rabbahu sai ne mu ga fara wajen ubangijin sa shi wa lalle ya laifi wa kharra raki'an sai ya fadi kan goshin sa yana mai sujada wa ana ku mai kuma ka daman daman ku mun manne ga sa idan an zo wannan gaban ana so mutum ya dora goshin sa a kasa idan ana karatu ne shi mai karatu ya dora goshin sa a kasa kai ma sai kai ko ba sai ka yalwa laba ko ba sai ka kalle alkibla ba idan ka zo kan wannan gaban ko ba ka alwa la ko ba ka kallo alkibla to sai ka dora goshin ka a kasa sunna ne za ka sanba lada sa'an nan wanda shi ma yake a tare da kai shi ma sai dora nashi goshin a kasa sai da ka sanba lada saboda waje da sujada insha Allah wannan zamu kwana na warais premium quality na warais mil suka dauki nauyin kawo muku na warais premium quality dan danon irin na daban ne ina ma abuta dillanci shinkafa da masen daidai ko sari warai kuna iya samun shinkafar na warais a nawo complex kusa da next shopping center kado district dake abuja nigeria kuna iya ziyartar ma ofishin mu dake floti mai lamba 807 gidado address way dake edo industrial area and extension fct abuja kazalika kuna iya tuntubar mu kai tsaye a lambobin karta kwana 0704 Nawarais mil suka dauki nauyin kawo muku. 